students how are you doing and uh, in our previous video i told you about the sentences today i am going to tell you about the different types of the sentences and uh, i have given you work uh, hope you have done this so uh, now we are going to start types of sentences so let's get start there are four kinds of sentences a statement expresses a fact or opinion it begins with a capital letter and ends with a full stop for example zara is a good student it is a opinion so this sentence is a statement next is mohit enjoys playing badminton this is fact so these are the examples of statement next is an imperative sentence expresses a request suggestion or command it also ends with a full stop we often being an imperative sentence with let's or please kya karte hain imperative sentences ko ya to please se start karte hain ya let's okay for example please chew your food slowly it's a request let's not argue about this it's a suggestion fetch a plate from the kitchen it's a command so these are the example of imperative sentences in your exercise c there are some sentences you have to put s for the statement or i for the imperative sentences first i am going to do this for you like please help me find my english notebook which sentence is this please help me find my english notebook we use here please so it is a imperative sentence so we will put i for this sentence you have to do uh, do this exercise according to statement or imperative sentences and next is interrogative sentences an interrogative sentence is ask a question it ends with a question mark jo interrogative sentence hote hain वो कौन से होते हैं जिसमें कि क्वेश्चन पूछा जाता है लाइक इज जारा ए गुड स्टूडेंट क्या जारा एक गुड स्टूडेंट है और डज मोहित एंजॉय प्लेइंग बैडमिंटन क्या मोहित बैडमिंटन खेलना एंजॉय करता है वी कैन चेंज अ स्टेटमेंट इन टू ए क्वेश्चन बाय एडिटिंग वर्ड्स सच एज इज are do or does at the beginning of the sentence for example zara enjoys mathematics and uh, in the question uh, interrogative sentence does zara enjoy mathematics mohit's friends are good children and in, in interrogative sentences are mohit's friends good children so according to this you have to do exercise d first i am going to tell you mummy bakes a cake every week so we will start from the does mummy bake a cake every week okay students you have to do d exercise like this students 
Look at the picture. There are some answers. We have to frame questions using question words. These are who, what, why, when, where, how and how many. The first answer is Raghav is holding an ice cream in his hand. We have to make the question. The question, the question should be what is Raghav holding in his hand? Next is he is standing by the roadside. The question should be where is he standing? Okay, like this you have to frame the questions of the given answer. You have to do this in your grammar notebook. Mm -hmm.